News. Thanks, Carla. And now to a terrifying wake up call for one Henrico family. These are photos from inside their Lakeside Avenue apartment where a ceiling collapsed right on top of a man as he slept. Tonight, we're hearing from that man and his family and getting answers from the apartment complex managers. Brittany McDonald joining us live with the story all new at 11 and Brittany, how in the world did this happen? Well, Kurt, you'll remember that yesterday was a total washout. You can see that things are still trying to dry out here tonight a day later. I'm told that had a lot to do with it. The roof couldn't handle the pressure and caved in. Holy crap, the ceiling fell on top of me while sleeping and I didn't wake up. You can see 22 year old William Martin was fast asleep at about 630 Tuesday morning when the ceiling of this country club apartment came crashing down on top of him. Well, I had debris all over me like I had in insulation and everything on me. His mother, Crystal Fisher, heard a loud bang from the other room and came running in to find the mess. Literally everything fell, the sheetrock, the insulation, everything. So you just looked up, saw support beams and then the roof. There was like there was nothing left. Martin would end up spending the rest of the morning in the hospital. I was throwing up from the time I woke up until about 12 o'clock. And get this, it's actually his 10 year old brother's room. He was just visiting. Fisher called emergency maintenance and they moved the family into another apartment where they've been spending the day trying to get settled with the items that were salvaged. Some of my stuff is ruined and broken. So what happened? Mark Dana Management Company out of Rockingham County says they've been working on the rehabilitation of all nine buildings of the complex over the past month. They admit there have been leaking problems in numerous apartments, and the last shingle replacement was 12 years ago. The renovation of Fisher's building wasn't yet complete. Everything is here, and I don't know what to do. Now, it's a great reminder to have renter's insurance, which fortunately Fisher does, so hopefully that'll cover the losses. On your side in Richmond, Brittany McDonald, NBC 12.